local, live, late breaking. This is Wedge 2 News at 11 in high definition. And new information tonight about a data breach at the University of Central Florida. More than 200 students reported having their debit and credit cards hacked, and now investigators know how. Well, she's Matt Grant shows us how some restaurants are making sure it doesn't happen again. Investigators say the massive UCF data breach was caused by a virus. This student is one of at least 230 who had their debit card numbers hacked. If it happened to 200 students here, you say? Yeah. College students are the richest. Yeah, college students are the richest people, so I was pretty peeled when my bank called. Them. UCF officials say malware was found on the computer systems used to process sales at Asia Chow, Huey Magoo's, and the Corner Cafe inside the student union. All are operated by the same company. Specifically, we're not sure how, how it happened. The general manager here says they're now taking debit cards again after temporarily switching to all cash after cyber criminals hacked their computer. Are you guys doing anything different now to make sure this doesn't happen again in the future? Um, stronger firewall, stronger software, uh, much more uh, focus on malware uh, protection. Computer expert Tom Jelnick says malware attacks aimed at businesses are becoming more common. So it could be a, a, something as simple and innocent as somebody clicking an email and it downloads something into the computer, runs in the background, nobody knows the difference. This latest incident comes several months after more than 63,000 social security numbers belonging to current and former students were also hacked. Officials do not believe the two incidents are connected. So this is like like midterm exam week for me, so I haven't even had time to check my card. So. What you're going to now? I am. <laughs> it's probably a good idea. Yeah, probably a good idea. UCF officials say uh, that it is safe now on campus to use your debit and credit cards. This is where most of the hacks occurred in the student union as students swipe their cards. If you feel you're the victim, you're urged to call UCF police and your credit card company immediately. We're live at UCF. Matt Grant, Washington News.